Okay, so this is what I'm doing at the moment. I'm going through my son's drawers. This kid has so many clothes. This isn't even all of them. He's got all shirts and stuff hanging up in a wardrobe in the older boy's room. So I'll get these piles sorted. I've got a Sammy's pile down here, bin pile here. Um, uh, just putting like uniforms. He's got all different size shorts. I picked up shorts from Best and Less a little while back. I got them at a really good price. So I've got all different sizes. So I've kind of put them from 9, 10, and they're 12s. Trackies, that's the shorts pile, hanging up shirts and uniform tops and stuff that he's going to keep. And that little pile is pretty much for when we go away. And I've got this pile here I'm going to give to my daughter for my little grandsons. He'll fit into that in no time. And then this I'm working on the pyjama section, which he doesn't really wear pyjamas, but he comes in our room freezing during the night. So once I've got it sorted, it should be easier for him find some jammies and I've just got me coffee going over here well that's my third and fourth one for the day just watching a bit of YouTube and yeah that's about it so this is one that I've really been enjoying Smiley Citrus she does all sorts of videos and yeah she's really good enjoy watching her vlogs so if you're looking for someone new to watch and it's got a new little puppy. He's so cute. So have a look at her channel if you want to. Got my little diffuser going in here. My room smells so nice. I think I've got one of the oils from Dusk in here. I think it's called Apulco or something like that. So beautiful. A bit weird though, these diffusers. Sometimes I've got to get a cotton bud and just like go in that bit and then it will work okay. It's a bit strange. Good morning, it is Saturday. We have just got back from the shops. We went down to get a couple of yoga mats for hubby and myself. Just need to start doing some yoga and stretch these old bodies for house. And I had to pop into Aldi and grab a few things. So I ended up going to two different Aldis because they didn't have dog roll for my dog. But then I ended up going to the other one and they didn't have any, they were run out. So I just ended up getting some cans. I'll talk, talk about that in a minute. But we got some chicken breast, I've got two packs of turkey mints, I've got some more blueberries, frozen ones, totally out of them for doing smoothies and stuff. Got a cauliflower, some more bananas, I've got some more of these sweet potato chips, they are so good. We had them last night for dinner, I forgot to vlog. I was at my friend's all day so I was pretty hangry when I got home. So we just had some sweet potato chips and we had a nice little pork um, steak, it was nice and lean and... What else did we have with it? Oh, just some steamed veggies, those microwave ones. That was really nice. Uh, got some mushrooms. They'll be for breakfast. I've got some minced garlic, a couple of red capsicums. I've got some of these veggies. I'm going to make the dog food for a goose. So I'm just going to cook some pasta, mix it with that, and I'm just going to mix in a couple of cans of dog food into it as well and put it in a big container for her. I've got another pack of light tasty cheese. We're nearly out. I've got a light sour cream. I've got some more taco seasoning. Um, that was all I got from the first one. And that was $73.21. And then the next one I went to, I was actually going to get chicken thighs at the first Audi, but my bags were really heavy and I was in there by myself, so I didn't worry about that. But I picked up a pack from the second shop. And it was lucky I checked because when I put it in the bag, I heard it make a noise and I broke the corner off it. I actually had to take the bit out of my boot. A few weeks ago, my car was smelling funky. And I realised that one of my chooks that I'd bought had a little hole in the bag. Oh, God, it was so disgusting. So I had to take that out and wash it and dry it all. I washed all my shopping bags in the bath. So that's good. They need to wash every now and then anyway. So, um, but got a bag of capsicums from Aldi. I think they were... $4.99, I want to say, and they're pretty nice. Got a bag of onions. They were $2. I wanted to get some from Woolworths. They're 99 cents um, there at the moment this week. And, yeah, just got the four cans of dog food. That's casserole one. And that's just lamb with pasta and vegetables. And I got some beans. They had some at the first one, but they weren't very nice. So I look at the second one, and they were good. So 
that cost me 41.82 so we got 7 8 9 10 11 13 14 about 115 dollars all up just for that which is crazy to think i used to be able to pretty much build this whole big table for 160 it's just insane but i'm going to pack this away and we're going to run down to the spud shed i want to get some sweet potato and i need to get some more um, of the really yummy gravy and i want to get some zucchinis as well i already had some but they were really small so i want to see what spud shed's got so i've just grabbed a few bags out my second drawer in my kitchen Aldi isn't doing plastic bags anymore to put your stuff in so you can never take your own we just got back from the shops so we went to the spud shed they didn't have any of my gravy so i spew on about that but i got a couple of these huge sweet potatoes they were only a dollar 99 a kilo so for both them it was nearly two and a half kilos and it was only four dollars 88 so that's pretty good gonna make a butter chicken during the week sometime so I said to hubby we'll have some of that and we'll just have some of the other meals during the week they had these onions for a dollar fifty a bag they're two kilos so got one of them and got two zucchinis that were 99 cents they're not really that great either but I'll cook some of them up for the brekkie tomorrow and I'll probably use the other one in the butter chicken so if I do the butter chicken maybe Monday get them um, use them up, you know, while they're still good. And I got a couple of these for the kiddos for the barley box. Uh, so my spud shed stuff came to $10.73. And then we went to Woolworths. One of my older boys wanted me to get some Lipton iced tea. They only had mango, which he doesn't really like. So um, probably see if the other boy wants, wants them instead. Got some cooked prawns. Those are normally about 20 bucks. So on special for $16.50. There's half a kilo in there. And we got some high green curry paste so i'm pretty sure i'm going to cook that tonight and hubby pointed out luxa one of the older boys loves luxa so we'll do that one night as well uh, another bag of onions i've got the capsicum so i'm just going to cook up onion and capsicum is going to be the sort of veggie for the week some uh avocados are six bucks for the bag i think there's a kilo in there oh what does it say oh, it just says five pack Yes, yeah, so that's pretty good. They had cucumbers, uh, $1.50. I got some of this chicken flavoured rice. Hubby and I are the only ones that like this, but yeah, I don't mind that. It's quite nice. Uh, we got some thin egg noodles. That's to go with the laksa. I got some of the almond spread. I only ever buy this when it's on special, but I didn't today because it was on special and I really wanted it for me apples. So bought one of those. So good on the Pink Lady apples. And I got some olive oil spray. And I've got some water chestnuts, that'll be for the Thai green curry. And I've got some firm tofu as well. I might put some of the tofu in with the curry as well. See how much chicken I've got left by the time I sort out my meals. But the total for the woolly stuff was 63.70. So, but we've got lots of nice healthy stuff for the week. So that's good, we're on the last week of school holidays, so. Yeah. So today we spent $189.76 on groceries and now I literally need to stay away from the shops. <laughs> I really need to do one of the just use whatever you have for, um, I was going to say a couple of weeks but I could probably get away with a month. I just don't know how to go with meat. That would be my only thing. But just got to use everything in the pantry and everything else that we have in the house. I'm just going to plan some meals out for the week and yeah, just check what I've got in your freezer and that. Normally I write it on my fridge with a whiteboard marker and cross it off as we use it. Um, I have still been doing that but I just need to have, have a look and see what's on there. And then just obviously add whatever I bought today to that list. Makes it so much easier than actually having to dig through your stuff and see what you've got and what you need and that kind of jazz. So, okay, I'll leave it here. Hope you enjoyed my little quick grocery haul and I'll see you in my next video, which is coming. Um, I, like I said, I forgot to video the meal from last night. So I'll vlog tonight's meal and add it onto that one and then I'll post that probably tomorrow. 
Thank you for watching. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. It really helps support my channel and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.